This video is brought to you by the EA Creator Network. I was able to play the game early, figure some stuff out to teach you guys, help you guys get better. And we're going to do that by helping you make people miss in the open field. Now, remember, this is a work in progress. This game can change from what you see now. But once again, I said from the EA Creator Network, they allowed me to play this game. Check it out. We're going to do just that. Let's find out some moves, boys. And Dummy is your Madden Bro, what is up with these guys? Can be super bummer, dude. All right, this is always my favorite way to find out what moves are good. This is this is offense only practice mode. All right. Now, before I get into it, I'll tell you guys right now, there's a huge difference between the great players that are doing moves, the regular players doing moves, essentially, and and you know, the bums. Like Jalen Milrow, I'm gonna pick him. I think he's the best. For some reason, he is like Devin Hester, Barry Sanders, Eric Dickerson on this game and no other quarterbacks really like that and you notice such a difference between an 80 spin 80 juke and a 90 juke 90 spin one of the best parts of playing regs is that you realize what guys can really make people miss and who can't but i'll show you moves that work with every single player so now we come from madden 24 which had the crazy juke or the crazy uh no trigger right stick juke now, let's talk about jukes to begin with in general read option. This way I can show you guys both the running back and essentially the, the quarterback, who is Jalen Milrow, who I think is the best at the open field moves, honestly. Now, juke this year, the best juke is with the turbo. I'll show you the difference. We're going to get a ball right here to our boy Milrow. That's no, no, no turbos right here. Turbo, you're kind of getting that Madden 24 look back to the game that Madden 24 so in Madden 24 there was a no turbo juke and this or no turbo juke was meta now we're going turbo turbo is the one that's going to get you those big distances and they're going to cover more ground and make more people miss so if you want to use a juke make sure you're holding the right trigger for turbo and you're clicking that right stick left or right that's what you want to do now I've said this in previous videos as far as jukes are concerned um, it's hard to juke somebody face running north and south. It really is. It's tough because you're kind of both running at the same angle. When you juke people, you kind of want to use angles against them. To not only juke, you know, your, your space, but use their angle against them as well. So the easiest way to tell you guys this, and if you watch, most of the time you're going to run to a pylon and juke to the other pylon. That's what I tell people all the time. So if I'm running here and the essentially the opponent or the defender is running right at me, I want to run to the left pylon, then I want to juke back to the right pylon. Run to the right, juke back to the left. Use those 45-degree angles rather than the 90s and stuff like that. That way, when the opponent is chasing you, they're, they're also running at a bad angle, and you can just use the angles against them and their pursuit. You can break their pursuit a lot easier, break their ankles a lot easier, by running pylon to pylon. So that's pretty much how I use juke in this game early in college football 25. Now, I think college football 25 and hopefully Madden 25 is the return of the spin move. Now, the spin move was kind of dead last couple of Maddens as after it was OP for a couple of years there. Now, it's 100% back. Now, the spin move is the one move that pretty much anybody can do. You don't got to be Jalen Milrow. You don't have to be the superstar players in the game, the Travis Hunters, the do the spin move. Anybody can do it. Now, there's the regular spin move. I'll show you guys. It's just B. Up, B. Everybody has this kind of spin move. And it, it will get by one person for sure. And you want to kind of play the angles the same way as I told you guys with the juke. You want to go kind of pylon to pylon, play their pursuit against them. Like, if I'm, if I'm running this way, I'm spinning that. I, it's hard to run straight line and get people like that. But you can. Essentially, you're going to run to that pylon, spin back to the other one. That's the best way I can tell you. That's no turbo, no left trigger, just B. Literally run here. I'm running. I'm holding turbo. Now I let go of turbo, spin. Let go of turbo, spin. Let go of turbo, spin. Now, what's OP now is the turbo spin. That's back to like Madden 22 when the spin move was awesome. The spin move was ridiculous. Now, this move, I don't think everybody does it the same. Turbo spin right there. Boom. Boom. It looks like Madden 22. or I, I think it was Madden 22. But Milrow honestly has the most ridiculous spin. He does it the best. You guys see it. it looks like Madden 22 spin. 
spin back that way. You can really cover a lot of ground. You can run completely horizontal back the other way, and you're going north and south. It is an insane move, and that's turbo and spin. But the same, the same principle applies. I'm running that pylon. Where am I spinning? Back to the direction of the other pylon. I'm running that pylon. Spin back to the other pylon. Pylon, 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 pylon. Always think about that in your mind of breaking down defenders. It's hard. It's hard to break, run straight at them. In fact, when you run straight at them, you're better off trucking or something like that. So turbo spin, no turbo spin. You see the difference. This one's a little more, obviously, a little more powerful. The no turbo spins a little quicker, and you can get by one person pretty easily. So the spin move has a multitude of different options, a multitude of different ways to use it. The juke is back with the turbo juke. Now, the juke is 100% player dependent. Like, if we see our boy Miller here, he's got a pretty good juke. You know, he's covering some decent ground here, right? And obviously, Milro does too. But if we're going to go ahead and give the ball here to our boy Dupree, the tight end, Turbo Juke. I mean, he's actually moving pretty good. But you see it's a lot slower and fatter. You know, but he's actually, I mean, he's actually kind of bouncing. Definitely a different animation. That's what you want to see. I felt like Madden 24, we were just, everybody was doing the same Juke for the most part. You, you can bounce the ball off to these, these, I guess this is Law right here, you fast guy. He. They just don't cover as much ground when you don't have that good Juke. And the spin move, Turbo Spin is just not there. But they still have the small spin. No turbo spin. They still have it. So remember your personnel when you're juking. Remember uh, how you're attacking. Remember all those things. Pylon to pylon. That's that's the biggest juke advice I can give you guys. Pylon to pylon. That's the best way you're going to be able to juke here. And obviously in Madden and also in College Football 25, pylon to pylon. Remember that. Juke with turbo. You can spin with both turbo and without turbo, boys. Those are the best moves in College Football 25.